Are you searching for purpose, meaning, and a deep sense of fulfillment in your life? Do you long for a personal relationship with God where His love and grace can transform your heart and guide your steps? The good news is that you can experience all of this and more by accepting Jesus Christ as your Lord and personal Savior. Regardless of your past mistakes, regrets, or sins, God's arms are open wide, ready to embrace you with His unconditional love and forgiveness. Here is a guide to help you take this life changing step one recognize your need for salvation acknowledge that you are a sinner in need of a savior understand that your own efforts cannot bridge the gap between you and God sin has separated humanity from him but God's love provides a way for reconciliation and eternal life for all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God Romans 3. 2. Understand God's love and provision. Grasp the magnitude of God's love for you. He sent His Son, Jesus Christ, to pay the price for your sins through His death on the cross. By accepting Jesus as your Savior, you can receive forgiveness and be reconciled to God. But God demonstrates His own love for us in this. While we were still sinners, Christ died for us. Romans 5. 8. 3. Repent and turn to God. Repentance is a vital step in accepting Jesus as your Savior. It involves a genuine remorse for your sins, a turning away from a life without God, and a decision to follow Him wholeheartedly. Repent, then, and turn to God, so that your sins may be wiped out. That times of refreshing may come from the Lord. Acts 3, 19, 4. Believe and confess Jesus as Lord. Place your faith in Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior. Believe that He is the Son of God, that He died for your sins, and that He rose again. Confess with your mouth that Jesus is Lord, declaring Him as the ruler of your life. If you declare with your mouth, Jesus is Lord, and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. Romans 10, 9, 5. Surrender your life to Jesus. Yield your life to Jesus Christ, inviting him to take control of every aspect. Submit your dreams, desires, and plans to his loving guidance. Allow His Holy Spirit to transform you from the inside out and lead you in the paths of righteousness. I have been crucified with Christ, and I no longer live, but Christ lives in me. The life I now live in the body, I live by faith in the Son of God, who loved me and gave Himself for me. Galatians 2, 20, 6. Seek baptism and join a Christian community. Baptism is an outward symbol of your inward commitment to Christ. Seek baptism as a public declaration of your faith and desire to follow Jesus. Additionally, connect with a local Christian community where you can grow in your faith, receive support, and be nurtured in your journey. Peter replied, Repent and be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Jesus Christ, for the forgiveness of your sins, and you will receive the gift of the Holy Spirit. Acts 2, 38, 7. Remember, no matter what you have done in your past, God's love and forgiveness are available to you. He longs for a personal relationship with you, desiring to transform your life and guide you on a path of purpose and fulfillment. Take this step of accepting Jesus Christ as your Lord and personal Savior and experience the joy and freedom that comes from being a child of God. For God so loved the world that He gave His one and only Son that whoever believes in Him shall not perish but have eternal life. John 3, 16, 8. 
Embrace God's grace and forgiveness. Understand that God's forgiveness is limitless and extends to every aspect of your life, no matter what you have done or how far you have strayed. God's grace is greater. Embrace His forgiveness and allow it to wash over you, knowing that you are completely forgiven and made new in Christ. If we confess our sins, He is faithful and just and will forgive us our sins and purify us from all unrighteousness. 1 John 1 9 9 Cultivate a daily relationship with God. Seek to develop a personal and intimate relationship with God through prayer, reading His Word, and spending time in His presence. As you draw near to Him, He will draw near to you, guiding and transforming your life. Draw near to God, and He will draw near to you. James 4, 8, 10. Walk in obedience to God's Word. As you grow in your faith, strive to live in obedience to God's commands and teachings found in the Bible. Allow His Word to be a lamp unto your feet and a guide for your path, shaping your thoughts, attitudes, and a guide for your path, shaping your thoughts, attitudes, and your Word is a lamp for my feet, a light on my path, Psalm 119, 105, 11. Share your faith with others. As a follower of Christ, share the good news of salvation and the transformative power of God's love with those around you. Let your life be a testimony of the change and hope you have found in Jesus, pointing others to Him. But in your hearts, revere Christ as Lord. Always be prepared to give an answer to everyone who asks you to give the reason for the hope that you have. 1 Peter 3, 15, 12 Remember, accepting Jesus Christ as your Lord and personal Savior is just the beginning of a lifelong journey. As you continue to walk with Him, seek Him wholeheartedly, and follow His leading, you will experience His love, guidance, purpose in ever deepening ways. Trust in His faithfulness, lean on His strength, and allow His love to transform your life from the inside out. 13. Seek the guidance of the Holy Spirit. Invite the Holy Spirit to be your constant companion and guide. The Holy Spirit empowers and equips believers, providing wisdom, discernment, and spiritual gifts. Yield to the leading of the Holy Spirit as you navigate through life, trusting that He will direct your steps and empower you to live a life that honors God. But the Advocate, the Holy Spirit, whom the Father will send in my name, will teach you all things and will remind you of everything I have said to you. John 14, 26, 14. Foster a lifestyle of gratitude and praise. Cultivate a heart of gratitude and praise as you journey with Christ. Regularly give thanks to God for His blessings, His faithfulness, and the transformative work He is doing in your life. Expressing gratitude and worshiping God keeps your focus on Him, strengthening your faith and filling you with joy. Give thanks in all circumstances, for this is God's will for you in Christ Jesus. 1 Thessalonians 5, 18, 15. Engage in consistent prayer. Develop a consistent prayer life, communicating with God regularly. Prayer is a powerful tool for connecting with God, seeking His guidance, finding comfort, and interceding for others. As you pray, pour out your heart, share your burdens, and listen for God's voice. Do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your requests to God. Philippians 4, 6, 16. Grow in discipleship. Engage in intentional growth 
as a disciple of Jesus Christ. Seek opportunities to study and apply the teachings of Jesus, allowing His words to shape your thoughts, attitudes, and actions. Surround yourself with fellow believers who can encourage and challenge you in your faith journey. Therefore, go and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, and teaching them to obey everything I have commanded you. And surely I am with you always to the very end of the age. Matthew 28, 17. Trust in God's timing and faithfulness. Remember that God's plans are perfect and His timing is impeccable. Trust in His faithfulness, even when circumstances seem uncertain or challenging. Hold fast to His promises, knowing that He is working all things together for your good. And we know that in all things, God works for the good of those who love Him, who have been called according to His purpose. Romans 8, 28, 18, walk in love and compassion. Embrace the love of Christ and let it overflow into your relationships and interactions with others. Extend grace, forgiveness, and compassion, just as God has shown to you. By demonstrating Christ's love, you become a reflection of His character and can impact lives with His transformative power. A new command I give you, love one another as I have loved you, so you must love one another. By this, everyone will know that you are my disciples if you love one another. John 13, 34, 35. As you continue to grow in your relationship with Jesus Christ, remember that he is with you every step of the way. Lean on his strength, immerse yourself in his word, and surrender your life to his loving care. Embrace the abundant life that comes from knowing Him and serving Him with your whole heart. Welcome to the family of God, where His love knows no bounds and His grace abounds in abundance. May your journey with Christ be filled with joy, peace, and an unwavering assurance of His presence.